Hello, my name is Alex and welcome to my Deco Network video. Today we're going to learn about the inventory add-on. Now the inventory add-on allows you to keep stock of all the products on your system, which is handy if you are managing a large number of products. It also takes away the hassle of having to do a manual um, stock take and having to manually enter the stock, stock data into an Excel spreadsheet. So to enable the inventory add-on, if I type in inventory into my universal search, I can see that my product inventory add-on is currently inactive. So if I click this, I'm given a pop-up for the product inventory add-on and I'm just going to click add now. So if I close this and head over to my products list, and in this example I'm just going to use my first product here. So if I select inventory on the left hand side, I can see that um, inventory is enabled for this product. And I get to choose which color and size combination I can um, choose to control the stock for. So I'm just going to tick the ones that I have. And I have three areas here. So this is the inventory on hand. So this is going to be the current stock level that I have at the time of enabling the product inventory add-on. So I'm just going to say 10. And I also have a low stock warning. So I'm going to put this at 5. And I also have a reorder 2 level. So I'm going to put this at 20. Now um, this reordering level will prompt products to be purchased on your next purchase order. So if your current level hits your low stock warning level of 5, it will prompt a purchase order for 20 products. And I can do this for each color and size combination. Now it doesn't have to be the same, it can be different. And you can set it to whatever number you want depending on how you want to manage this. So with some details input there, I can now save and that is me now controlling the inventory for this product. So if I now come back to my inventory and if I put a few items down to the warning level and click save. If I now head over to my settings and select inventory settings, I can see here the system has prompted a warning here to say that two of my products have hit the warning level and if I'm using the purchase orders then the system will also generate me a purchase order ready for me to send off and if I'm not using purchase orders and I'm doing things manually out of the system I can come into here and I can also update my inventory after I've ordered and simply save. I also have some additional options on the out of stock behavior. So what will happen when a customer tries to add and check out with a product that's currently out of stock. So I can either do nothing and allow the user to check out as normal or I can prompt a warning to the customer to say that this item is out of stock. So I'm just going to keep this as do nothing just because when I hit my warning level my system is going to generate me a purchase order which I can, I can then send off to my supplier. So I'm going to click save and that is how you manage the inventory for your products on Deco Network.